All right, I've gone in and reset the valves on this thing to 20 thousandths, <clears throat> which is what I was told they were supposed to be. Um, I didn't really look it up on the Briggs site. I just went by what I found on several different forums that the valve adjustment is supposed to be 20 thousandths. So what I did, I adjusted those and it does roll over a lot easier now, but it still wasn't starting. So I pulled the plug out and of course it looked like it was fouled. Bring you over here for a second. This is the plug that was in it and it had all kinds of oil and stuff, oil and gas both caked in the top of it there. So I got to thinking, well, maybe the plug's just fouled and pulled it out and got the one out of my John Deere here, this one, put it on there, rolled it over, nothing, dead. So just to make sure it wasn't the plug, I brought the plug over here. This tractor runs like a dream, so there's no reason it shouldn't actually spark. So just to make sure that the plug's not fouled, I'm gonna try it out on this one. And you should see it sparking. Now, there we go. So the plug's fine. What that leaves me with is that the coil pack is gone on that one also. So now I have two that need coil packs. This one and that one. I don't know, I got that one kind of uncovered now. I've been pulling weeds out here. But uh, that one, I'm not really sure what it needs. I was told that all I have to do is mount it up and let me get over there and show it to you. Now this one, all I gotta do is get the mounting bolts for it and figure out how these two things hook up. That one comes from the stator. Not really sure what that one's for right off. But either way, those both have to connect to these. Now these wires are color coded too and I can kind of match them up that way but I'd rather just have the plug. So I've actually been looking for a 24 horsepower stator that I can put on this one and just plug the plug right up into that one. That's the reason I haven't done anything else with this one so far. The stator at the Cub Cadet dealer is $56 and the main pulley is 34 don't have that for either one of them so for right now again this thing is kind of put to the side but once I get it running it'll be a massive little beast but that's what I got for this little project today thanks for watching